Greetings, friends. Good afternoon. Happy Thursday. Hoping that all watching are happy and safe and having a great holiday season thus far. So today I thought I'd go ahead and uh, post a little video, uh, do a devotional reading from Jesus Lives by Miss Sarah Young. So today's devotional is regarding joy, and it says to be joyful always, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances. The only way to be joyful consistently is to take pleasure in your invincible, invincible relationship with me, the one who rules the universe. This relationship is full of hope, so it is possible to be joyful in hope, even in the midst of ongoing affliction. Amen. The simplest way to find joy in me is to give thanks in all circumstances. There is immense power in praying simply, Thank you, Jesus. This brief prayer is appropriate for all times and all situations. Because of my great sacrifice for you, I encourage you to thank me for every good thing as soon as you become aware of it. This practice adds sparkle to your blessings, increasing your joy. It also helps you pray continually, persistently, perseveringly. Amen. When you are feeling dull or downhearted, it is still a good time to thank me. This tiny act of gratitude can brighten your perspective immediately. To deepen your thankfulness, ponder specific things about that delight you. For instance, my lavish grace, my unfailing love, my continual presence, Giving thanks in all circumstances is a joyous discipline. It empowers you to lift up your soul and to live close to me. Amen and praise God. And then here with the, the scriptures for today, for the reading, it says to be joyful always. Pray continually. Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. From 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verses 16 through 18. Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction faithful in prayer. Romans chapter 12, verse 12. In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins in accordance with the riches of God's grace that he lavished us with all wisdom and understanding. Ephesians chapter 1, verses 7 through 8. Let the morning bring me word of your unfailing love, for I have put my trust in you. Show me the way that I should go, for I lift for you I lift up my soul. From Psalm chapters uh, 143, verse 8. So again, hoping all are well, happy, and blessed, and having a great, fabulous week. God is good. God is sovereign. Uh, totally always in control and on the throne. Wishing again all a well, happy, and safe holiday, blessed season. Holla! Amen.